Hello friends, you might find this error after running WSL update command. Follow the steps to fix it. Click on search, type control, click on control panel, select uninstall a program, here click on turn windows switches on or off. On this window, make sure that virtual machine platform and windows hypervisor platform both are checked. If they are unchecked, check them and click on OK. Let the features install. Click on restart now. If virtual machine platform and windows hypervisor platform are already checked, then uncheck them and click on OK. Restart your computer and then again go to control panel and programs and features window from windows features again check both the options and then click on ok then restart your computer the issue will be fixed that's all friends thanks for watching the video